Hello guys, Zanjay here and in this video I am going to review the CM 12.1 Nightlies which are released for the Euphoria and uh, I have been using this ROM since its launch and I have to say that it's really really awesome because some of the bugs which were present in the stock ROM like the real cyanogenoids which comes pre-installed with the Euphoria there were some bugs in that ROM but in CM 12.1 Nightlies some of those bugs were really fixed like the proximity sensor bug when we use double tap to wake is not there in the CM 12.1 Nightly and guys, if you want to know how to install this ROM on the Euphoria, then I'll give a guide of how to install ROM on the Euphoria in the description box below. Just follow that guide and there will be no issues with the installation of ROM. And the sound quality is a little bit improved from the CF Cyanogen OS and even the pinkish tint which is present on the Cyanogen OS over there uh, is not present over here. And even if you feel like there is a pinkish tint on the screen, that can be removed easily. For that, just go into settings, then go into display and lights. Then select live display and select color calibration. You can use this and you can change the settings over here and you can adjust the display color according to your size. Like if I just move it over here somewhere, then the display colors will be different and you can adjust it according to your use. Like if you like, if you think that this is pure white, then you can keep this at this setting or if you feel like this should be here somewhere, then you can keep it like this too. But by having it at 100% uh, is also very good. So there are tons of options present in the Nightlies which are which may or may not be present in the Cyanogen OS which comes pre-installed. So let's start with the features and first of all let's talk about some of the important points about this ROM is that first thing is the battery life and as you can see the battery life is like very good as you can see in the screenshots that I have taken I, every day I got more than 4 hours of screen on time with medium to heavy use and that's surely a very nice thing because uh, usually custom ROMs may or may not give you that much good battery life but surely CM 12.1 nightly is uh, giving a very very good battery life so that's a plus point for the CM 12.1 and if we go into about phone you will be able to see that this ROM is based on 5.1.1 and that's the latest android that we can have uh, android m is released but we cannot have that because that's still a developer preview so it's based on pi.1.1 and that's a good thing because you get few new things from 5.0.2 to 5.1.1 like you can just swipe up the notification uh, when they hover around over here and if you just swipe up the notifications then the notifications will be present in the notification bar but in 5.0.2 you do not have such facility and after that let's talk about the bugs in the ROM and personally I'll say that I did not find any any major bug that will hinder my day to day life performance everything works from Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, SIM cards, data pack everything I mean everything works very very fine no issues whatsoever plus the sound quality through the Euphoria is like very very good there are no issues with the sound quality too rather I felt that the sound quality on the CM 12.1 was little better than the Cyanogen OS but surely when incremental update comes for that uh, Cyanogen OS then the audio quality over there will be also very good so no issues with that and one more problem that I was having on the Cyanogen OS was that while typing the keyboard uh, did not pick correctly and it used to mistype sometimes but uh, in the CM 12.1 nightlies uh, there is no issue like that I can type very fast and there will not be any issues and uh, you said that there will be a new firmware update for the Euphoria in Cyanogen OS that's the pre-installed OS which I am saying again and again so I am pretty much sure that that firmware will be present in the current night list so, uh, as the notification is here we can just swipe up from here and the notification will stay in the notification bar so that's surely a nice thing which is present in 5.1.1 you may not find this feature in 5.0.2 so now let's talk about the camera performance on the CM 12.1 nightly and as you can see I have installed the Cyanogen OS 12 camera over here otherwise uh, Google camera is pre-installed on the ROM and let's click some pictures so let's click this picture so as you can see the camera is also very good no issues with that so the picture is very clear crisp and it, it clicks the pictures as if we are on the stock ROM and as you can see in the sample pictures too the photos taken are really awesome and with the front facing camera also there are no issues and this is the apple watch which i bought for my friend for 120 rupees uh, obviously we can't buy the apple watch so i am happy with this and when it comes to overall performance of the rom uh, i have to say that the overall performance is also very good gaming experience with the rom is also very good there are no issues with the gaming too and i played several games and there were no issues whatsoever with the gameplay too
and there are no graphical glitches in the rom so that's surely a nice thing Uh, so let's get back so gaming experience is very good on the rom and there are no graphical glitches in the rom too everything works super fine no issues whatsoever all the animations are smooth and overall performance is also very good and i would like to mention that there were zero force closures that i that i personally faced right now but in future updates you might face some bugs over here and there but there's nothing to worry about because this is a custom rom and uh, it it is bound to have few minor bugs here and there and i don't have any problem with that too and if you want to know how i install this camera application then i'll give the link of this zip file to install gallery stock gallery application and the stock camera application in the description box below simply flash the zip file through twrp recovery and you will get gallery and camera application on the euphoria and as these are sanusion mod nightly every day the rom is updated so you cannot download 300 mb every day and flash the rom so there is one better and simple way uh you can download this app cyan delta uh simply download that app and it will show you the nightlies which are which you can flash and uh, simply select that nightlies download the nightly and flash this if you want to know how the cyan delta app works i have already made a video on that and i'll give that link in the description box below and i i completely completely suggest you to watch that video because as you can see we are downloading 30 mb over here right now and the complete rom is of 300 mb what this app does is it only downloads the things which are only up, which are updated and not all the things so that's surely a nice thing and the things like call quality messaging and whatsapp everything like that works very smooth there are no issues with the call quality and anything like that too and i would rate this rom 9.5 out of 10 because the rom is really really awesome and considering this rom is released just in 10 to 20 days after the uh, public release of the euphoria and i'm pretty much sure that euphoria is one of the fastest device to get the nightly so fast i mean even the oneplus one got the nightly a little late and that's so euphoria got it so fast so i am i'm like uh, speechless so and that's a very good thing because euphoria just cost around 7000 uh, less than 7000 rather and it got the nightly and that too so much stable so i'm really very very happy with it and i'm pretty much sure that i'm going to stay on the nightly only and rather than going to sanus noise i prefer nightly always so yeah and uh, the rom is also very good so no issues with that and if you guys have any doubts suggestions or queries regarding the cm 12.1 on euphoria then do let me know about that in the comment section below so this is it for this video guys thank you for watching and don't forget to hit the like button if you like this video and don't forget to comment down below if you have any doubts and don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more videos on euphoria so thank you guys thank you for watching